Well, it is Ash Wednesday, which means the Lenten season is officially here. This is a live look inside St. Mary of Mercy Church in downtown Pittsburgh, where Bishop David Zubik is celebrating Mass even as we speak. Amy Wattis is there outside, and Amy, this really is a different kind of Lenten season in Ash Wednesday. Well, John, it sure is. Divine Mercy Parish is holding mass here right now this Ash Wednesday. And as you said, things are different this year because of the COVID-19 pandemic. Parishioners will not be receiving ashes on their forehead. Instead, these ashes will be blessed, then sprinkled with holy water and then sprinkled on the top of your head. And the Catholic Church isn't the only one switching up things this year. Many other congregations around Pittsburgh are making things COVID friendly. This is for you. One by one, the cars lined up in the parking lot of Faith Lutheran Church in White Oak. People came out for the annual Ash or Dash drive through on this holy day. I work two jobs, and so I work this, today during the day and then tonight, so I don't have time to get ashes, so this is perfect. Time is everything, and this year, so is safety. This year's a little different because it is time of COVID, and we can't go and put ashes on people's foreheads so we're giving away um, patches two different options patches with um, that are made of sackcloth which is a traditional sign of penitence um, marked with a cross faith lutheran church teamed up with nearby samson's mills presbyterian church to make this event possible to celebrate the start of the Lenten season. It's a sign of remembering that we are mortal and that we are fragile, that uh, we also are people who make mistakes and are in need of God's grace. Tom McFadden says safety is what's most important. There's no difference. Um, you know, it's a, it's a symbol and, and you have to practice your faith. So um, I think it's a good idea, actually. It is different, but I think we have to come up with creative ways to continue our, um, you know, our faith and celebrations and the things that are meaningful to us. If you missed this morning's event, never fear. Faith Lutheran Church is distributing ashes all day. Only they'll be using a clean Q-tip to mark the sign of the cross on your forehead. This way we could stay far enough away. Um, and we think it's safe and, and uh, responsible way. And we have more details on that on our website, kdka.com. And if you weren't able to make this mass at noon at St. Mary's, Bishop Zubik will be celebrating another mass tonight at 6 at St. Paul Cathedral in Oakland. Reporting live downtown, Amy Wattis, KDKA News.